The Chief of Staff to the President, Femi Bajabia Mila, on Tuesday handed over an 80-bed hospital to Lagos State Government, which includes a pediatrics unit and a dialysis center. The Femi Bajabia Mila General Hospital, located in the Suruleri area of Lagos State, also includes a 300 kVA generator, a 100 kVA solar generator, as well as a borehole and water filtration system. Speaking at the inauguration of the four-story hospital, Bajabia Mila, who spent 20 years in the House of Representatives, said the project was one of the many he had completed in the state to augment the efforts of the state government. I am proud that we have constructed over 250 roads in selected federal constituencies in the state. Advances in medical health services and technology have made it possible for people to survive previously on survivable diagnosis. For those of us who serve in the government, our primary objective must be to ensure that citizens have access to quality healthcare services offered by professionals in environments conducive to recuperation, healing, and recovery. We've seen development in tertiary institution, education. We've seen development in infrastructure on road. We've seen development in youth empowerment, in social integration, in sporting facility. We've seen development in health. What more collaboration can we ask for? What more engagement can we ask for in people's governance? And they've said to us that this is a first-class facility that will take care of various health issues and health challenges. And I'm indeed excited and happy that we're beginning to resolve all of the challenges that we have in that sector. Thank you very much for this intervention. This facility is a critical infrastructural intervention at this time when our need for conducive spaces to carry out administrative and academic engagement continues to grow as our staff and students' population increase. It is therefore a welcome addition to our infrastructural facility. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.